Kris Jenner can't explain her chemistry with Corey Gamble but admits she was skeptical about their 25-year age gap. He taught me that age is just a number. It's a effing big number, but it's a number. Chris quipped while discussing her 10-year relationship with Corey. 10 years have passed but Kris Jenner is still head over heels for Corey Gamble. On the May 30th episode of The Kardashians, Chris and Corey jetted off to Europe for Paris Fashion Week to support Kendall Jenner as she walked in the L'Oreal show. Hello. If you're new here please do not forget to subscribe, like and hit the notification bell to remain updated. While there, the couple made sure to carve out some romantic one-on-one -on -one time as Chris, 68, explained that Paris held extra significance to her and Corey, 43. I love being in Paris with Corey because Corey and I started dating in Paris, so he always plans a really special night for us while we're here, she explained. Upon arriving at their dinner, Chris quipped, why do I feel like I'm on an episode of The Bachelorette? She certainly wasn't far off as she noted the intimate meal featured an outdoor dining experience, complete with a full moon, the glittering Eiffel Tower in view and us without kids. In a confessional, Chris opened up more about her relationship with Corey and their 25-year age gap. I used to say to Corey all the time when I first started dating him, like why do you want to date somebody who is older than you, she recalled. I didn't get the age gap, and then he taught me that age is just a number. It's a effing big number, but it's a number. She then added listen, I can't explain someone's chemistry or why people fall in love but it's been an amazing almost 10 years, and we have a great time. Chris and Corey first connected in August 2014 while they were both in Ibiza to attend the 40th birthday party of their mutual friend, fashion designer Ricardo Tassi. They began dating shortly after, and have been together ever since. The two tend to keep their romance generally private, though they often attend red carpet events together, occasionally rave about each other on social media and even put out a holiday card together in 2022. Corey also appeared on episodes of Keeping Up With The Kardashians and now on The Kardashians. In early 2021, Chris spoke about Corey in an interview with WSJ magazine, telling the outlet that he was an incredible support system who was adored by her family. He's the greatest guy, and he's just an amazing support system for me, and he really gives me a lot of strength and insight. He's a great sounding board, and he loves my kids and my mom, and they love him, she said. Chris Jenner admits Corey Gamble's Yellowstone casting sparked her jealousy, so she forced him to reject role while speaking to people about the launch of her new personal branding masterclass in July 2022. Chris opened up about how her longtime boyfriend has helped her along her career journey. I think Corey is super. He's an amazing guy, she said. He's really supportive and he's really dialed into a lot of the different things. He's very knowledgeable about a lot of the things that I work on, and he really helps me in trying to think through some of the decisions I make. He's such a great person to bounce things off of. I really love his point of view on things. She also noted that Corey is a people person who thrives helping me navigate such a huge team and all the things that are happening. Everybody needs somebody to sort of run something by and help make decisions about the littlest things. It could be a travel, or it could be what you're doing that evening, or it could be what's going on at the office today. But it's really great to have him, she added. Thanks for watching till the end.